Alright guys, welcome back to another video. So today we will be installing a suction clothes hanger for our shower glass door. Stay tuned. Also, if this video helps you out, make sure you like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss another video. Alright, so we will be installing two hangers for our glass door and one of them will be installing right here and the other one will install right next to it. So normally we keep our towel on this rack right here, but we'll be installing these hangers so that we can hang our clothes. So we got these hangers right here. They came in a pack of four, but you can also get a pack of two. So we got a pack of four because the pack of four is actually a little bit cheaper. So we got these hangers right here and you can see that they are suction based. So uh, when you are installing them, all you have to do is press it on and then twist it and it's very easy to install. So we're just going to do some math in order to find the location of where we're going to put these hangers. We want them to be equally distanced from each other so that there's an equal distance on either side of these hangers as well. So put uh, is 7 inches from the top end. And this was the total was 32 and a half. So we divide 32 and a half into 3, which is 10 and a half. So 10 and a half, 1, and from this side 10 and a half, and middle 10 and a half. So we do exactly 3 spaces 10 and a half, 10 and a half, 10 and a half. Now we will stick it outside, so we put the tips other side of the glass and then marked on the tape so that after sticking we can remove the tape. So we will be first removing this, this thing, we need to Make sure this surface is clean, so wipe it off very nicely. Sure, it is in the center. Uh, the hook, hook is vertical. Make the hook vertical, and then turn it. clockwise and that's it we got one of one connected and we just same thing remove this cover and make sure that this is uh, horizontal Make sure this is right in the center. And then just 
fold it like this and rotate it I got another one for for our squeegee on a game like this it was connected like this two piece separate so I just unscrewed it and this one goes in like this and then we just screw it back in Once it is in, if we screw more in, it creates suction. So let's try again. So we want somewhere like this. Okay, so looks tight. It can be tilted. And what is our squeegee? So we can put the squeegee right here, like this. Okay. Put uh, two hooks there for our uh, uh, shower robe and and other clothes these two additional we'll put it like this here um, the corner we have planned to put a cabinet so we want to hang our clothes here i have tried to center it in this tile so one gap, middle gap and side gap, three equal gap I, I want to make. So about here. Now, once we know the place, we'll wipe off the place with the uh, wet towel. Make sure it is really clean. Once we make sure it is clean, we wipe off with a dry tissue paper and then we open this plastic it is already sticky they have put it's like a glue and then suction so it's really very strong so we'll put one here make sure this is vertical and then just rotate this to create additional suction first we attached it with the blue and then by rotating I created additional suction I'll put the second one same thing open the plastic this is really clean and sticky Put like this, just eyeballing. I could have done it really is by measuring accurately, but I'm just eyeballing it for the moment. So it is vertical. Now I just rotate it.
so it is uh, stick with glue and suction both I can actually if it is not vertical I can make it vertical later on so that's not a problem okay so that's it all right guys thank you for making it to the end of this video as you can see here is the end result if you have any more questions make sure to ask in the comments down below and if this video helped you out make sure you subscribe so you can find more videos like this from us once again we'll see you in the next video